Experiment log 369248-B. iBot DuraFrame Universal Interface Override System. This is Dr. Whitley presiding. We've boosted signal gain and enlarged the overflow buffer system. That should ensure 100% connectivity and control. Eddie, whenever you're ready. Yes, success. <clears throat> um, reporting full success on 369248-B. Eddie was able to interface with and override the test panel in under three seconds. Great job, team. Now let's start on the proposal for the full rollout. Colonel Autumn. He feels the iBot DuraFrame project isn't advancing quickly enough. I'm too. You didn't even disengage his damage avoidance protocols. You're hurting him. Don't be ridiculous. It's just a machine. See here. I've already increased the navigation system's efficiency by 65%. Get the hell out of here. Fine, Whitley. It's your lab. At least until I tell the Colonel about this. Kill 
each other. The divide was stronger. Left marks on them too. Not bear, not bull. Now, radiations mark them, made them equal in history's eyes. As vicious as the storms are, these shadows of Legion, of NCR, silhouettes of things to come. for you. 
you. That's one of the things you taught me. Killing is personal. So is vows, promises. Last bits more important to me than the first. What kind of world would this be if Courier killed Courier? You've got enough distance ahead of you. Save your breath for the road. Don't waste it on words. War. Call it that. Our part in it. Ulysses wasn't made for the flag he followed. He wasn't made for peace. That's the lesson. If you follow a symbol to the end, ask yourself what that means. More important, ask what happens after the end.
I'd explain this to the colonel. Just because the iBots don't have true AI doesn't mean they're just machines. I guess results are all that matter around here. Forget things like ethical procedures or humane treatment. I'm starting to have serious misgivings about leadership around here. At least I've got you to talk to, huh, Eddie? Many 
NCR were already here when the destruction happened, keeping the route east open in fear of Kaisar, fear of the Legion. The dam, that old world wall, the bear, NCR, couldn't be allowed to reach it easily. Long 15, Cayman, both bad enough. Kimball, Kaiser, House. You'd think their whole world was that wall, cutting the Colorado. If I'd never laid eyes on it, never spoke of it. But once found, it was all Kaisar could see. That, and the flag beyond it, another symbol, big enough to challenge him. And the divide, one of the roads to it. Legion was tasked with cutting that artery. If you can't kill the bear in one stroke, bleed it, starve it. That kind of murder. It's what any of the Legion would have done. Now, the Divide belongs to history. The bear false versions of Legate Denise's mask, the one Kaisar fashioned for him, thought it was an insult at first. No better now. It's shaped from Divide metal, not with care and strength. But with hate, keeps them anchored. Crude, effective, like the blades they carry. Distant mirrors of their legate, a symbol they can hold on to, while the divide tears at them. For the two-headed bear, NCR, they don't have symbols in the same way Legion does. They revere their mines and explosives, guns. That is their religion. Death from afar. Take pride in it. At the end of the high road lies Ashton. It's Silo. That machine I'm with you. It can open it, wake it up. Like it did the one in Hopeville. Hate? No. There's nothing to hate in metal, steel, gold, or platinum. You're a machine. It's just a tool made of wreckage of the divide. All that was brought here. You know the why of it. If you don't, I do. And that's enough. Shows trust only walks so far west. Earned more than that, though, getting this far. We walk the same road, carry the same colors. Can't break that by making the road red. Want more than that? Walk the divide. Answers will come closer you get to home. You and that machine. Many in the Mojave think the divide's nothing but canyon and storm. Wasn't always. There was life. A town farther west. Not talking about an old world town like Hopeville. More recent. Something you saw in your lifetime. It had the name, the divide, too. But rather than cracks in the earth, it was a road from the west into the Mojave, a supply line. Took a courier to make that road. You. Back then, you saw the road with eyes facing east. This time, the divide's in the other direction. And if your eyes try to make sense of it when you reach it, Homes, not what it was. All roads lead back to one's home. Not your birthplace, maybe. But home. Home isn't where you were born into this world. You top 
me that part of your message, whether you meant it or not, can be a place of mind, a moment where you know who you are, the history of it, and they can be places you breathe life into. Never would have known the divide had it not been for you. The road you made with your tracks again and again. You were the only one willing to make the journey to and from here. A hard road. Kept the land before the divide alive through seasons, storms. Can't have been just the job. Was something more to you. Don't feel for place that hard unless it's home. It means everything. Even if you deny it, cast it aside. That speaks to what you are, proves what happened here. It was you walking that road that kept the divide alive. It grew from what you did. Settlers, camps, filling that old world city. Chance for a new mission, new beginning, new way of thinking. Could have breathed new life into the Mojave, bridging east, west, like Hoover Dam. But not old world. Something you made. Road or the supply line. <laughs> not anymore. If one existed, the two-headed bear would have claimed it. And it tried to. NCR saw the worth in that road you made. Staked a claim whether it was wanted there or not. True elsewhere in the Mojave. And where the bear tries to cling to life, the Legion comes, bearing messages. Some brought by blade, others by couriers. You knew what was coming, as sure as I know what's coming for you. This time you carry the burden. Walk west into the sun and keep walking until it dies. There, I'll be waiting. It, all, all due respect, sir, I think you're making a mistake. We're close to a breakthrough with the Duraframe iBots. I can feel it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, I understand that we need the Duraframe assets for Hellfire armor, but... No, sir. Yes, sir. I understand, sir. I'll tell the team to start disassembling the ED series prototypes right away. Eddie, you little rascal, were you eavesdropping again? I think those videos you watch are a bad influence on you. How much of that did you hear? Hmm. Didn't Dr. Grant say she'd upgraded your navigational systems? And I think I have an idea. How'd you like to be just like Ralphie? Tiny cracks in the earth, 
nothing compared to the road carved ahead. Before you, this is the edge of the divide. Ahead lies your work, the history you burned in the earth, what you brought to the people here. You delivered a package, had markings that matched those in the divide. Not all, but enough. Military markings from some place the bear had savaged in the west. Maybe seeing those markings on it reminded you of home, made you carry it. It was a device, a detonator, one I'd never seen before or heard before. You carried that thing to the divide. I know because I followed you as you walked the road, watched you do it. You brought it here to the community you built and you are responsible for what happened after when the device opened, started to speak. When it did, the divide answered back. Those missiles you've seen buried in their silos. They exploded beneath the ground, cracked the landscape, sand, ash, the dead. The divide skies became a graveyard. I've walked the east. You've walked the west more than I have. Circle Junction, Reno, Vault City. Word of you at Fort Aradesh. Fort Abandon. Even further west than that, Brahman drives on the big circle. Whatever you saw out there wasn't enough to make you stay. Maybe the markings on the package reminded you of the road home. Machinery, simple on the outside. Computer parts, inside, more complicated. Was the only time I'd heard a machine speak in the divide. The only machine with a voice. Should have died there, but now that I know you live, the machines here saved me. I was the only survivor, or thought I was. Your package, the message inside, awoke medical machines, close to the one that shadows you, began to build themselves, then others. They only take what parts they find in the divide, never roam beyond it. Can't even leave the silos without a human to shadow. Like hounds. Maybe they saw the flag on my jacket. Thought I was of America. If so, history saved me. A sign. Blame. Accident. The names you hang on this. Courier. You carry death. Wherever you go, Mojave knows, or will. I'll see you answer for this. The road doesn't end here. There's more to come. I swear to you. What happened here can happen again. You already proved it. What you did in Ashton, the silo there. Didn't stop you, though. Like carrying the chip to Vegas. Old world death in your hand. Pieces of the old world like that just need someone careless enough to take them where they need to go to do their killing. All these roads you walked, these packages that you carried, think it wasn't your choice? Of course, it was your choice. You could have stayed in the Mojave, but you chose to come, couldn't let be, not in you to let go. Came for no other reason than you were curious, restless, always have been. Had to know the why of it. Now I'll show you. Active. 
Ignorant. Ignorance is a choice. The chip, a choice. As for anger, it is what I carry for the dead and all that come here. The soldiers of the bear, they were dead already. Their symbol, diseased. Deserved to die as my brothers did at Boulder City. Mines. Bombs. I carry nothing for them. Their deaths here were a mercy compared to the ones that still walk the divide. My family. My tribe lives. Its history died long ago, fell under the shadow of the bull, consumed by another symbol. No, this isn't about family or any common blood. It's blood shared by acts, not by chance. The supply line, the artery for the West, I have seen the blood of NCR at Legion hands many times. I carry no hatred for duty, if that's what this was. The divide was more than that. It's people more than that. The community that was once here and the package you brought. Both had markings of the divide, markings of America. You've seen the marks, the symbol, as early as the Hopeville silo, maybe. Carried it etched on your weapons. The divide, its buildings, its people, were built around those same markings, surrounded them here. Markings like the flag on my back when I followed a Euro road to the divide those years ago. I saw the symbol I wore all around me. An old world symbol, strong to survive here. Its people, strong. Outlast the bear, outlast the bull. Promise of something better. Kaiser was right to want it dead. NCR was right to want to rake their claws in it. Seeing it changed me. Just as seeing Hoover Dam changed Kaiser and the NCR. Seeing it end changed me too. There was hope here. Another chance, a new nation, stirring to life, a place I could have set my flag. Not the America of old, but something larger than the tribes of the East, something larger than the houses of the West, something better. The divide could have bridged both, like Hoover Dam. Now like the dam, it's too covered in blood to see what it could have been. You gave life to this place. I followed a your road here, saw the divide. You led me here so that I could see. Then you brought it to an end. My history isn't revenge or hate. The road that brought us both here isn't about that. It's about the message you carried, the one in that package, whether you knew it or not. The message that one can kill a nation, can kill a symbol, and all that gather beneath its flag. I don't blame you for the divide. I blame you for what you made me see. Now you will see what you brought to the Mojave, and that will be my message to you. The nations 
bones of Moali, cracked and broken as the divide, its people the same. I have walked at Kaisar's command across the east into the west, far enough to know Kaisar's word did not drive me, far enough to see the end. You've seen it. No courier, whatever their flag, can ignore it. Why you didn't stay in the West. Why you wondered. There's no future in the bear or bull. The bear is diseased, barely clings to life. And the bull, when the legion reaches the sea, it will turn on itself and die. Killing one will end both. And you made me see how one could do it. Your ignorance, carelessness, can be used with a purpose. Really? Who's to say the truth of it? You? No. You walked from this, turned your back on it. Now you and others will answer for it. I'll start with the West. Let that burn. Then, if the East falters after, I'll bring the Divide there as well. Burn away the flags. Begin again. Your roads are not done. Haven't walked it full yet. Not nearly enough. The way ahead and below leads to the heart of the divide. And there, you and I, we'll have an ending to things. Already heard you once, long ago, and loud enough for history to hear, tired of your messages. Still, curiosity drove you this far. Let's see what else it can do. Kaisar's orders. Some time before, I realized the why of it. Wasn't just you. All couriers. No telling how many were legion. Maybe all of them. Wasn't sure about you until the divide. All the NCR burning. That much death. It bears the mark of a legion hand. But you killed like NCR. Like Hanlon. With mines, bombs, missiles. Killed legion along with the bear. Like a coward. Kills from a distance. If you were a legion, then NCR beat you. The West changed you. I know that now. Doesn't change what was done. The Legion who died here. Even if you were a Legion, you would answer for those deaths by Kaisar's law. I knew all of you. Your name. Your road to and from the Divide. What that meant for the Legion. We never spoke. Knew you through your actions. Knew you'd walked the West as I'd walked the East. Learned different lessons. And I would never have discovered the Divide without you. You know what it was. Had the symbols of America on it. New markings from after the Great War. Thought it might be America come again. Promise of another future, another flag. It was a piece of machinery, military, holding memories, codes maybe. When it woke, made these sounds, words. When it spoke, the divide became fire. The ground tore apart like the skies. Through it all, kept calling out. Maybe calling for home. Machine couldn't speak by itself. 
needed a terminal to access it, like the terminals in the silos here, or the machine with you. When it was connected, it started speaking, and the divide answered. You've seen the divide, walked it farther than I thought you would. Not sure how much farther you have in you. If you need answers, speak. You've earned them. Even if only you and I can carry them from here. At the end of the divide, through the trenches and wreckage, that's where you'll find me. A new home, here, amongst dead men. You and that machine. Keep your eyes on the tower that cuts the horizon. You'll find your way. Made it this far. Not much farther to go. Dad? Hey, Dad! Check out this robot I found! Careful, Tommy. I've never seen a robot like that before. It might be dangerous. He's not dangerous. Look, he's hurt. Can we take him home, Dad? Maybe Mom can fix him. I don't know, son. What if someone comes looking for it? Please. He looks so lonely. Maybe if Mom fixes him, he can help her out around the garage. <sighs> All right, boy. But if he breaks anything, it's coming out of your allowance. Yay! He'll be just like Ralphie. Only this one's not a toy. Next week on Ralphie the Robot's Incredible Odyssey. Ralphie, hurry! If mean old General Winters catches you, you'll never make it home! No! Ralphie, fly far, fly fast! Tune in next Saturday for the exciting conclusion. Only on Vault Tech Channel 9. Eddie? What are you doing in here all alone? And who left these old videos playing? Come on, let's get you into your recharge bay. We've got a big day tomorrow. explosion, that building falling deep in the divide, might have been your work. Wouldn't kill you. Maybe close. Knew you'd survive, but no need to go any farther. You've brought me what I need. That machine with you, sealed in the Hopeville silo. Needed someone to unlock it, bring it home. Now the signal's strong enough. No need for you to carry it anymore. I can call your machine to me. You gave it a name. What was it to you? 
companion, slave, weapon, all of that, nothing compared to its primary function. It's a messenger, like us, and it shares our history. If you feel its loss, remember, you could have turned away at any time, gone back home, and none of this would have happened. But you had to make one last delivery, and that's why I knew you'd come a courier. Couldn't stay away. It's who you are. The machine you brought is mine now. It's coming home. I'll reduce it to parts, just enough to function, to be aware of what's happening. What's inside that machine? That's all that mattered. All the machines here, made of wreckage from the divide, and all that was brought here. Inside its frame, it carries the message you brought here, and it'll do what it was programmed to do, whatever it can to get home. The giants here will listen to it. I'll bring the divide to your home, your nation. Let its flag burn, just like you let the divide burn. Big mountain access code. Ulysses, command override. Navarro. This place, NCR's shadow falls. Or is it just you, courier, without the bear's corpse to weigh you down? Judging by your shadow, maybe you can't let your machine go. Doesn't matter now. Either way, the Divide Giants are awakening. The missiles here on their way home. There is no way to stop them. No. Now there is purpose. I believe you when you say you were careless. The divide. The chip. The machine you brought here. Many messages can be taken from that. Intended or not. What I do now is an act of conviction. Blame you? No. Learned from you. Both the weapon to kill a nation, and the strength to do it. You showed me a road, a way to carry my message. You've already answered for what you've done. Now the flag you follow will answer for it. No, not the Mojave. The West. All that's been built since America died. Same symbols as before the war. Now a flag carried by a tribe of children. You walked the west, didn't stay. You know the reason. The bear grows without structure, follows a symbol without knowing its history. And knowing that you believe in a bear's sickness and have given it strength, and that gives more reason to lay waste to your homeland. After this, only one flag will remain over the Mojave. Let that one fly, or destroy itself. <laughs> no need to destroy 
by the bear, just cut its throat. You taught me that at the Divide. Only need to cut off the supply line, the road, to watch something greater die. I'll turn the long 15 into miles of fire. Cut off the Mojave. NCR will fall back, lose Hoover Dam, and leave their throats exposed to the Legion. Your actions have carried strength. If you speak for the two-headed bear, I'll hear your words, even if I will be the only one to hear them. If you believe it should not die this day, then answer me why. History has proven this. Our history. And you think that you have this strength enough for all of NCR. The West is not the Divide, and nothing you can do can prevent the missile's launch. Convincing me changes nothing. It may be that as much destruction has been written in the Earth here, you may build something else as you built the Divide. You have spoken truly. There is a shadow of a nation behind you, the hope of a people. Yet it may not matter. The Divide still stands against us. Our enemies gather outside. Shadows of the bear and a bull. They will have found their way in, just as you did. It was always my intention. In case I could not kill you, the marked men would flood this place, cut off your escape. If we cannot prevent what comes, then let us make our stand here. Two couriers together at the Divide. Experiment log 369248-A. I bought DuraFrame Universal Interface Override System. This is Dr. Whitley presiding. Initial tests of the override system are promising. Against unsecured or lightly encrypted targets, the iBots have a 98% success rate. More heavily protected systems are still problematic. Military-grade encryption presents a very real possibility of critical overload of key systems. We've stopped tests before any robots were destroyed. But if we don't address the problem, our iBots will fry themselves hacking military networks. Hopeville burned, lightless in the night. Invisible fires of radiation scorching it from within and without. It is said a man still walked its streets with a tattered jacket and old world flag etched on the back. He remained there, perhaps as punishment for the scars he left on the wastes or a reminder of a history he could not forget. For Ulysses, his journey was over. The courier had been the end of his road. As for the courier, he turned his back on his home for the second time and made his way back, navigating the treachery of the Divide. Tunnelers and the marked men avoided the lone figure, as if recognizing the courier's right to passage, or out of fear. 
The courier walked until he stood again upon the edge of the divide, the last road he would walk before the second battle for Hoover Dam. There, beside his feet, was a final package from one courier to another, a footlocker bearing a gift and a message. But that message, it is something for couriers to carry and for them alone. The lights flickered across the divide, reminders that the old world histories persist and find meaning in the present. It said, war, war never changes. Men do through the roads they walk. And this road has reached its end. Full circle, walked your road, now back again. Something else in you needing an answer. A question one could have asked you not long ago, before walking the road west into the storms. Need to be here, see what was done. It's custom of the bear to never see the marks it claws in the land. Not my custom. Maybe that's why you've come to need to see where the missile from Ashton touched ground down below in Hopeville, the courier's mile. My name for it. If you have a better one, you grant it. My choice in names won't carry past you and I. Lies along the road, running from the Hopeville silo, straight onto where the ground burns and wind howls even stronger than here. That's part of why I'm here. Watch them. If they attack me, try to enter the Mojave. I answer, not looking to kill them. Save them, if I can. There might be something saving in them. If not, then what I do is mercy, not murder. The invisible fires burn here, true enough. Still, to have helped carry out such an act, then not face it, not to my way. If my life burns out here, so be it. Until then, I wait and watch, see what the road brings. Something else in you needing an answer? Didn't think I'd be breathing to hear you say that. Message isn't important. Meaning is. Had to speak of it in case the words got lost in paper, ink, or others' voices. Maybe even yours in time. Still meant for you. Courier to courier. Belongs to you now. Or history. Doesn't matter. House spoke, acted through machines. Sometimes can judge a man by his messengers. Sometimes the messengers judge him. Wonder what happens to Vegas now. The tribes, families. We'll see. What you did was for the best. The old world died long ago. Anyone who believes they can make it return, and everything will be as it was. It is a dangerous belief. Needs to be silenced before their belief spreads. If you saw a house, you didn't see a man. An old world spirit, perhaps. Filthy, diseased. If so, killing him was mercy, not cruelty. walk there sometimes. Keep the walks short. Still, it's important to see. Something else to answer for. Occasionally sift through the dust, the buildings. See if I can find some history. Marks of America. If you want them, keep them. You've earned it. Nothing to be gained by me holding them. And more will surface in time. 
not a camp. Vigil, maybe. Never claimed it as mine. If anyone owns the Divide, your claim is stronger than mine. Don't feel like adding a campfire to the ones that already burn below. If you brought Mojave gifts, might be able to shape something for the road. Depends what history has to say about them. There's a lot the land can provide, if you know the road that led to it. Mojave's got ways of healing most ills. If not, some tribes are usually found a way you didn't expect. Like healing powders. Tribes back west only use Xander and rock flower. There's a way the twin mothers in the east used to brew it, though. Called it bitter drink. Mixed up the Xander and Brock in a bottle. Added some kick to it, so your head doesn't get all clouded. History. Cures a wound, leaves the bitterness that caused it. The twin mothers were always about lessons. Kaisar taught them the last one, though. So that's it for them. Recipe still exists. Legion uses it on forced marches with wounded soldiers. Wouldn't have made it through Crimson River Trail a few years back without it. Losing so much blood early on was a Casador feast. Enough Xander root and Brock flower along the trail, though. The Legion was able to keep pace and get where they were going. Can do that, and one better. Just enough around to mix some. Here. Might make the twin mother's history live a little longer. You carrying it. When you drink it, down it all in one shot, or your stomach's not going to want to keep going after the second drink. Old world wall, run red with blood of bear and bull. It'll bleed more before the sun sets on the Mojave. That place and I have a past. Owe it a debt, and it owes me. If your path takes you there, no, you're not the only one. It's the wall by which this age will be measured, the gravestone of the Mojave. Old world never meant it as such. Names die twice to history. If the West thanks you, the East won't, in time, fall apart. Back to the tribes, maybe. Too soon to tell what will happen. Let history weigh what you've done, if it gets that far. Kaisar would be history's hypocrite if he was angry about what happened. I'm not one for it either. Seems you just proved his philosophy to him. If he'd been stronger, he'd be alive, and we wouldn't be talking. Unless you do the same for the legate that comes, you'll get no thanks from me. When that monster arrives, he's not going to have a leash. Kaiser could command him. Not now. The bear is going to burn, and burn slow. Can hear the weight in your feet. You're bound for that old world wall, Hoover Dam. Maybe not now. In time. Bear and bull shed too much blood there to let it go. Can't stop you from going. Wouldn't. A warning, though. The legate Lenius, whether Kaisar stands or not, Lenius will come. Lenius, a butcher, monster, terror of the East. Not even his slaves have seen his face. Struck them blind so they can't. Wears a mask. Don't even know if it's the same man. He put Colorado to the sword. Broke the hangdogs by throwing their hounds upon the flames. So they might burn forever in the afterlife. 
take Hoover Dam. Legion will need something as big as the old world itself. Another symbol forged by history. Aeneas carries all the terrors of the East with him. He's the myth, the weapon that Legion needs. When he arrives, he'll fall on Hoover Dam like a hammer. Break the bear in two. Nineteen tribes could not do it. All the lights in Vegas cannot. His strength lies in his title, and it is his weakness. He will not fight a losing battle and destroy what he represents. Put the idea of loss in him. Convince him the bear will not be the twentieth tribe beneath his heel. It will make him pause like nothing on earth. You do not need to convince him alone. Draw upon history. The past of other legates are not filled with victories. Remind Linnaeus of this. Yes. Graham was broken on the wall of the dam. Kaiser had him burned and cast into the earth. Into the largest canyon you've ever seen. Watched the flames trail all the way to the bottom. Somehow, Joshua walked away from that. Went beyond Kaisar's gaze. His footsteps trailing fire. Walking from one hell. Maybe to another. When one is ruined like Graham was. Sometimes home is the only place left. If so, he went to New Canaan. Kaisar's anger written on him like a book. Kaisar's orders to the Frumentari were to watch for him, find Graham, kill him. Didn't try. Could've. No good would have come of it. Graham earned his life and his nature. It'll kill him more surely than any blade of the Legion. So, if you've heard word of it or seen sign of him, let it keep. Let his history keep. Then there is nothing more to be done. The Mojave awaits.